We're on the eve of banishing polio from our planet. For many of us, it's only a memory. But until a few years ago, this disease ravaged the world. The last mile is proving to be the toughest, with superstition, war and vaccine resistance all playing a part. My name is Lisa, I'm 20 and I've just had my first baby. So I'm trying to find out a bit more about why we need these vaccines, if they're safe, and try and figure out the fact from the fiction. She's just had her first set of jabs, but I was just wondering, how long afterwards do you think that they can actually, you know, get really poorly? Um, they tend not to get very poorly after vaccines because okay. they're, not, they're not able to actually cause illness. Um, OK. So how, what percentage of the, sort of the population do you think would not be vaccinated and would be like, OK, this is becoming an epidemic again? I've been thinking about this herd immunity that people talk about. The herd immunity as a concept is a very beautiful concept. When a sufficient number of a population are immunised, then the remaining few who may be non-immunised would be less likely to suffer from the disease. What made the difference in India when finally India eradicated polio was, a, was well, not technical. It was a political decision. It was not the responsibility of UNICEF, of WHO, of whoever, but it was the government's responsibility. So I'm wondering how countries could be motivated to utilize the savings that they derive from their various healthcare programs. Once you can uh, show any money saved um, and reinvested will really go towards improving visibly the health of the population. I think most governments will be persuaded to put the money in. But you know, I think most people will relate to an appeal from a politician who has heart. You ever felt like you wanted to give up? Not at all. Not at all. Two weeks ago, at 5 a.m., there was a bomb blast. And you know, calls keep coming left and right. Are you not coming back home? Do you want them to bomb you over there? And I said, there are still children to be rich over there. Let me complete my assignment. When I'm done, I'll be back home.